In Vedic Maths, we are going to learn one more technique that is Antayor Dasa KP. Antayor Dasa KP means the numbers which are summing up to n, summing up to 10 at the end. Or I can say in another words uh, to make you understand easily, units place adding to 10 and the remaining digits same. Suppose if you want to multiply two numbers, if you want to multiply two numbers, whose units place digits are adding to 10 and the remaining numbers are same there is an easy way to find out the to find out the product of those numbers for example let us take suppose if i want to multiply 24 into 26 i want to multiply 24 into 26 now you can observe this is a units place and this is a tens place so in units place or in the ones place 4 and 6 is there what is 4 plus 6? What is 4 plus 6? 10 only. And at the same time, the tens place or the remaining digits are the same? Yes. If these two conditions are applicable to the numbers, there is one easy technique. What? How to get the product of these numbers? You simply do one thing. What is 4 into 6? 24. So write 24 here. Okay. And so what is the tens place digit here 2 2 should be multiplied with its next number what is the next number of 2 3 so what is 2 into 3 6 so your answer is 624 one more example suppose if you want to multiply say uh, 43 into 47 43 into 47 so once plus adding to 10 3 plus 7 equal to 10 first condition is okay what about the second condition the remaining place digits are should be same 4 and 4 yes they are same now simply what is the first step multiply 3 in the multiply the digits in the ones place what is 3 7 21 and to get the remaining answer what you need to do the digit which is in the remaining places that should be multiplied with its next number or next digit what is the next digit of 4 5 so multiply with 5 4 5 is a 20 so your answer is 2021 one more example i want to multiply 93 into 97 3 7 is a 21 so 9 into multiplied by 10 90 so your answer is 9021 suppose even you can extend this technique to the even hundreds place also for example i want to multiply 123 into 127 i want to multiply 123 into 127 similarly tens place one place is adding to 10 okay the remaining digits are same yes the remaining digits are same in both the numbers now three sevens are first multiply these two digits in the ones place three sevens are 21 and the remaining numbers should be multiplied with its next number 12 what is the next number of 12 13 so 12 into 13 12 into 13 is 156 so what is your answer 156 to 1 one more example suppose i want to multiply 289 into 281 i want to multiply 289 into 281 the rightmost digit is adding to 10 no problem the remaining places same both the conditions are applicable so what is 9 into 1 9 so 28 should be multiplied with its next number 29 so 28 into 29 how much it is so 28 into 29 so 9 to 1 is 9 so 28 into 29 so 28 into 29 is how much 812 but remember one thing the right side part of the answer should consist of at least two digits right right side part of the answer should consist of at least two digits so if it is nine means you have to write zero nine okay so what is the final answer you got eight one two zero nine one more example see here here we are taking the base as multiple of 10 here we are taking base as multiple of 10 so that's why the right side part even if you got the right side part as single digit okay uh, there is no much problem fine now what is 331 into 339 so 1 into 9 9 but it is 0 9 
so 33 into 34 33 into 34 how much 1089 plus 33 1089 plus 30 is how much 1019 1022 so answer is 102209 so like this we can calculate okay any numbers which are ending in uh, the digits which are summing up to 10 and at the same time the remaining places will be same so this is what antayo does be that is units place adding to 10 and the remaining digits same now we will see one more new technique in, in our vedic maths so here so 1 into 9 it is 9 but actually it is not 9 it is 0 9 now 33 into 34 we need to do so 33 into 34 how can you do if you know 33 square okay what is 33 square 1089 just simply add one more 33 33 to that number 1089 plus 33 it is double one double two so your answer is double one double two zero nine so like this we can calculate the numbers which are uh, ending in the digits which are summing up to 10 and at the same time the remaining digits should be same by using the principle anterior the second that is the units place adding to 10 and the remaining place uh, or the remaining digits should be the same now we'll see the one more new technique in the vedic maths we are going to learn the uh, some sort of same kind of technique which we have previously discussed but this time the units place is same but the remaining digits are adding up to 10 let us see one example suppose if i want to multiply say uh, 24 into 84 24 into 84 this time the units place is 4 and 4 both are same but the tens place if you observe 2 and 8 both are adding up to 10 or not yes they are adding up to 10 right so they are adding up to 10 so for this kind of numbers how can we do the multiplication easily now you please see here what is 2 8 times 2 8 times it is 16 but six to the 16 add the right side digit 16 plus 4 how much 20 so right here 20 now what is 4 4 times 16 so your answer is 2016 one more example uh, let us take some uh, 73 into 33 see we can uh, take this technique just like a l shape technique we can take it as l shape technique first what I am doing, first of all, I am uh, checking the numbers whether the tens place is adding to 10 or not. 7 plus 3, 10. Yes, they are adding up to 10. And check the ones place digits. Are they same or not? Yes, they are same. So the two conditions are applying. Then just go with this technique. Take the L shape here. Okay. Like this. Here, these two digits we need to multiply. 7 3 is a 21. Okay, for the 21, you need to add the right side digit. 7, 3 is a 21. 21 plus 3, 24. So, right here, 24. Now, what is 3, 3 is a 9. But, you need to place one more 0 here. So, answer is 2, 4, 0, 9. One more example. 87 into, okay, 23. Sorry, 87 into 27. If you want to multiply 87 into 27, how will you do? Same, go for the L-shape technique. First multiply 8 to the 16. 16 plus right side digit, 7. 16 plus 7, 23. So right here, 23. Now what is 7, 7? 49. So what is your answer? 2, 3, 4, 9. Suppose, uh, 67 into 47. 67 into 47. Same, 6, 4 is a 24. 24 plus 7, 31. Now what is 7 7? 49. So your answer is 3149. In the same way, 93 into say uh, 13. 93 into 13. What is 9 1 is a 9? 9 plus 3, 12. So what is uh, 3 3 is a 9? But it is 0 9. So your answer is 1 2 0 9. Got it? Similarly. Uh, 48 into say some uh, 68 so 4 6 are 24 24 plus 8 32 so I write here 32 what is 8 is a 64 so your answer is 3 to 64 
So like this, we can calculate any double digit into double digit numbers, which are whose ones places are same, but the remaining digit places, okay, adding to 10. So this is the method, the units place same and the remaining places adding up to 10. Okay.